After teasers, Huawei has officially launched the Mate XT Ultimate design, as the world's first commercially available phone with a tri-folding display. The Mate XT sports a chameleon-like screen that transforms depending on your needs. Closed, it's a fairly standard 6.4-inch Full HD Plus phone. Unfolded halfway, and you've got a larger 7.9-inch 2K screen, ideal for watching videos or catching up on emails. But the real magic happens when you fully unfurl the beast. A tablet-sized 10.2-inch 3K display unfurls for a desktop-like experience. The phone's thickness when fully open is just 3.6 mm while it measures 12.8 mm thick when folded. That's just slightly thicker than the Z Fold 6 a 12.1 mm body. Additionally, Huawei claims a 25% increase in bend resistance compared to other foldables, but real-world testing will be crucial to see if the tri-fold design holds up to daily wear and tear. Huawei hasn't revealed the processor yet, but according to rumors, it could be the Kirin 9000 chip we've seen on the Pura 70 series. The camera system is a capable one. It features a 50 megapixels main sensor with variable aperture paired with a 12 megapixels ultrawide and 12 megapixels periscope telephoto that completes the rear setup. An 8 megapixels front facing camera handles selfies and video calls. Despite a complex hinge design and the whole tri fold structure, Huawei has managed to squeeze in a fairly large batter in the Mate XT. It's a 5,600 mAh silicon carbon battery, is claimed to be the world's thinnest, and supports 66-watt wired fast charging and 50-watt wireless. Alongside the tri-fold, Huawei introduced a foldable touch keyboard that pairs with the Mate XT for a desktop-like experience. It can be a useful accessory for productivity enthusiasts. The Huawei Mate XT Ultimate design is available in black and red, with the 16GB plus 256GB model priced at US$2,808. The higher tier 16GB plus 512GB version costs US$3,089, and the top end 16GB plus 1TB model is priced at US$3,370. It is already available for pre order with sales starting in China on September 20th.